Hello pretties, welcome to Rest of So today I have my empties and I'm pretty excited. I have pretty good empties. Is it my best empties? No, no it's not. But I have empties and that's a good thing. I do think that the next update, the next update, it's gonna be good. I know I said that about this one, my fault. It's gonna be the next one, for sure. Watch my project cut update. <laughs> um, anyway, for skincare, because we always gotta do that. I have this one that I finished from Neova. So our skin scare is a body repair. Um, supposedly this won like a Nobel Prize because it can actually like repair DNA. I don't know about any of that. But what I do know is that it was nice cream, but it was super expensive. I would not be purchasing it. I, it was nice, but I don't know that I could tell that it was doing all that repairing. Maybe it's because I'm still young. <laughs> and so you couldn't really tell, but there's that. I did finish it though, super expensive. But yeah. I have my super goop sunscreen. This one, every couple months you're gonna see it because I use it every single day. It has been done. Throw it in the trash. Alright. Uh, another skincare one. I have a mini 8H Magic Night Serum. I actually really enjoyed this. This was really nice. I don't know the brand. Uh, n I cut off the brand's name. Uh, Nutri K? No, that's not it. I honestly don't know because I, I cut through the name. If you know the brand, please leave in the in the comment section below. But it was nice serum. I really liked it. Let's see what else we got. Skincare. You guys know I go through these. Um, I have hyaluronic acid from The Ordinary. Also from The Ordinary, I have rosehip oil. So, yep. I need to repurchase that one. And I was just at Ulta earlier today and I forgot to pick it up. I'm so mad about that. All right, empties, uh, makeup empties. Not as many as you would think. Um, technically, this one's a declutcher, but I'm still gonna show it to you guys. And it's this right here. It's the shade Side to Side from the ColourPop Sweet Talk palette. It honestly just fell out of a pen. It, I think it happened in my last project pen update. It just fell out of a pen. Um, and I have carpet in my room and I have obviously Really large dogs that shit all the time. I didn't feel it was sanitary for me to like try to fix that, so I'm just calling it as a as it is, which is a a declutter, and I'm just gonna throw it in the in the trash for this one. All right, and empties. So one that you guys should not have been surprised by now because I, I I've been talking about it in my project plan for a couple months now, but it's my Sigma color corrector. So the big bin for the end of the year. So satisfying that is so satisfying <laughs> um and then i have my mascara i switch out my mascara every four months even if i technically have a bit more product i technically have a bit more product right now i i used this earlier today but it's been four months i'm calling it and then i have my milani concealer this one was a bitch and a half to finish but I'm so glad it's gone, and I already have a repurchase. I love this concealer. I'm going to keep repurchasing it. I I do believe this is the most high-coverage concealer I've come across with a, a good formula. It's not my favorite formula, but it's a good formula. So nice. And everything else that we have left is lip products. <sighs> lip products. Okay, so we have the Makeup by Mario Rose Glow Mini. I hated this. Go. I technically, I know it's Persona Cosmetics, but it's actually the Ofra, no Ofra, um, Odin's Eye, there you go. I can't remember the name, but it was from Odin's Eye, it was a, um, what's it called, a lip stain. It didn't do that great of staining, it did some staining, um, but it was okay. I just, the wand had fallen off of that one, and so I just took all the product out, because it was essentially brand new, I just put into this, because at that time I had just finished this, the original product. I actually have a backup of the original Persona Hibiscus, which I really enjoy, but <laughs> gone. <laughs> and then this one you guys don't know about, because I haven't talked about it really anywhere, but I have this little bit from uh, Just a Tint, uh, from Colourpop, and it's the Gimme S'more, but I finished it. And I do believe I'm going to probably get one more of these done for the end of the year. I'm already working on it. It's essentially, honestly, the color was, does not work for me. And I have another one that the color does not work for me either. So what I do is whenever I'm about to go on a run and I, instead of putting like lip balm, I'll put one of, I'll put one of this. Because it is a technically a balm. So I've been using this as a balm. Or whenever I'm like going out and I'm not wearing any makeup, I'll just put this on my lips. 
such a wondrous. So, another empty. Not my best empties, I'm aware. But again, if you saw my last project pen update, you know what's about to go down. So, please do not forget to like and subscribe. I'm really excited to know what exciting products you've like completed recently because I'm curious. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.